When you listen to General Flynn's answer to what Michael Isikoff asks him next, remember what he read in this letter. Michael Iskoff asks him, were you paid for that event? And now remember, as you listen to the answer, that he re received this letter saying, if you are ever in a position where you would receive an emolument from a foreign government or from an entity that might be controlled by a foreign government, be sure to obtain advanced approval from the army prior to acceptance. So an invitation like that speaking invitation in Russia is something that Michael Flynn has to take very seriously. He has to know who's paying him. He has to. He has to know how much he's being paid. Listen to this answer. Were you paid for that event? I, you'd have to ask my, uh, the folks that, that uh, went over there to... to uh, well, I'm asking you. You'd, you'd know if you were paid. Yeah, I mean, I, I went over there as a speaking event. It was a speaking event. And what you, difference does that make? Well, I mean, I mean, somebody go, oh, he's paid by the Russians. Well, Donald Trump has made a lot of the fact that uh, Hillary Clinton has taken money from Wall Street. Yeah, I didn't take Sachs. any money from Russia, if, you, if that's what you're asking me. Well, then who paid you? Uh, my, my Speaker's Bureau. Ask them. Okay. Credibility. That is what's at stake here. Michael Flynn's credibility. It's all about credibility in the answer that you just heard. Who paid you? You have to believe in the answer that Michael Flynn just gave that he didn't know who paid him. He's going to have to do much better in his answer for the inspector general's investigation. And he's going to have to have an even better answer for the FBI. When the FBI asks Michael Flynn who paid him, he will risk perjury charges if every word of his answer is not true.